Hard to believe, but it's true. The Volvo XC90 has been on the market for nearly a decade with few significant updates. Granted, the Swedish luxury SUV's design still looks good inside and out, but aren't you ready for something new? We sure are. That's why we're pleased to announce that Volvo has finally given the XC90 a thorough update for the 2025.5 model year. Wait, what's that? You like the existing XC90. You don't want it to change. You don't want it to ever change. Well, friend, you're in luck because the XC90 hasn't actually changed that much. Actually, it's barely changed at all. Those seeking upheaval in their three-row Volvo SUV can explore the new X90 electric model that'll share showroom space with the updated XC90. Unless you're a long-time XC90 owner or a Volvo dealer, you'll probably need side-by-side -side photos to tell the new 2025.5 XC90 apart from the existing one. The updated XC90s won't arrive until the first quarter, Hence the half-year designation, the front fascia wears the biggest difference, and the new grille which drops its vertical slats for cool-looking diagonals is the most noticeable change. Other details, in case they aren't immediately obvious, which they aren't, include new T-shaped Thor's hammer headlights that blend into the wider grille. A full-width lower air intake complemented by two vertical scoops and slightly reshaped fenders and hood. Out back, the taillights have been darkened and the rear bumper has been revised to de-emphasize the tailpipes, all the wheels are new as well. Inside you'll find the one change we've been angling for, a larger screen 11.2 inch versus the old 9 inch screen with higher resolution but still in the sensible portrait orientation we like. The interface is new, too, brought over from the Ali Electric EX90, and the 360-degree parking camera has been improved. The dashboard has been redesigned with a horizontal line motif, and the center console has been rearranged to be more space-efficient. There are bio-friendly upholstery options, a new speaker mesh for the optional Bowers and Wilkins stereo, and improved ambient lighting. Lastly, the suspension has been updated with new frequency selective damping shocks, which Volvo says will improve ride quality. These pieces work by passively adjusting their damping depending on the speed of a wheel impact. Sharper impacts get firmer damping, preventing or slowing any slamming into the bump stops or full droop wheel extension, while softer, slower impacts are met with softer, more compliant damping. Powertrains are unchanged, you can still get the B5 and B6 mild hybrids as well as the T8 plug-in, which offers a claimed 32 miles of EPA-rated electric-only range. All powertrains are built around the same 2.0-liter gasoline engine. Some good news for owners of other Volvo models, assuming they're the only people who will read this far. That new interface will come to older Volvo models courtesy of an over-the-air update. Ready for a changed XC90? The 2025.5 model will arrive in Volvo dealerships during the first quarter of 2025 with pricing starting at $59,745 an increase of $1,850 over the current version. And if you're one of those people who really don't want to see the XC90 change, you'll be able to buy the existing model, badged as a 2025, for a few months yet. Thanks for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe and like.